Hey everybody, this is Brett, and this 2022 Jeep Wrangler two-door Rubicon is stock number 22J97. I am here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used Jeep Wrangler headquarters. This 2022 Jeep Wrangler Rubicon has the two-liter four-cylinder turbocharged engine. It puts out 270 horsepower. It's gonna get you 24 miles per gallon on the highway, 22 miles per gallon in the city for an average of 23 miles per gallon. Stingray is the color on the, this Jeep, uh, one of the hottest colors that we've seen on the Wranglers, most popular. Uh, the two doors are very popular. I can't even believe that I got this in here to get a video on it. Um, somebody actually looked at it just yesterday. It just came in. So uh, I was lucky enough to get a video on this one. You get the LED lighting group on this Wrangler. We're gonna go all the way around inside, check out the original window sticker, all the options, uh, go under the hood. I'm gonna turn all the lights on at the end of the video. This won't be a very long video since it's just a two door, um, but we'll start off here. If you like this video, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper right hand part of the screen. Let's get started. You get the red tow hooks with the Rubicon package, the LED fog lamps, LED headlamps, and the LED running lights. You get the seven slotted grill there. That's for every continent that Jeep has been on. You get the Rubicon stickers on the side. No, those are just stickers. If you didn't like them, you could take them off. You get the trail rated badge on the driver's side and the granite crystal Jeep lettering with the red outlines as well as the Wrangler um, logo there. Color match fenders. Color match hardtop on this one. That color match hardtop is a pretty expensive option, so we'll, uh, we'll check that out in the original window sticker. Uh, this one has the 17 inch painted and polished aluminum lipped um, rims. These are about a $1,095 option. BF Goodrich all-terrain TA tires. These are LT28570 R17s. They got definitely an all-terrain tread pattern to them. This one comes with the rock rails as well. Now remember the Rubicon has the sway bar disconnect as well as the axle locks and that's what makes it a Rubicon. You get the uh, T50 on the door hinges there. I actually have a video showing you how to take your door hinges off of your JL if you want to try that out or uh, check that out. That video is in the upper right hand part of the screen. You get the little sandals on that uh, plastic there. You get the little Jeep climbing up the side of the windshield. So the color match hardtop looks really good on here. And when you get the color match fenders, you get this 3M tape that goes on the front of the fender. I can't tell you how many times I've seen used Wranglers come in with those just, just beat up from rocks and everything, but it's nice, Jeep puts a guard on there from the factory. So here is a copy of the original window sticker. I have no idea where the actual window sticker went for this thing. Um, maybe the salesman took it when he showed it yesterday. Anyways, 2022 Jeep Wrangler Rubicon. I'm not going to go through everything, but most of it. Uh, the two liter four cylinder dual overhead cam turbo engine with start stop, eight speed automatic transmission. You get the Jeep Wave membership, the 8.4 radio and premium audio group, which I thought was pretty neat. Everything on your left there is your standard equipment for the Rubicon package. Android Auto, Apple CarPlay, um, exterior features. Uh, you get the uh, the rims there, red tow hooks, power heated mirrors. Um, so that's all standard Sirius Guardian for a year and Sirius Travel Link and Traffic Plus for five years. Now your optional equipment is the Stingray Clear Coat, which is 395. Leather trim bucket seats are 1995. The Cold Weather Group, which is 1195, gives you the heated seats, heated steering wheel and remote start. The LED lighting group is $15.95. I definitely think that that's worth every penny. Um, having a Wrangler before, the halogen's lights just are not as nice as those LEDs. HB automatic transmission is $2,000, and then the three-piece color hardtop is $2,695. The color body color Rubicon Highline Flare is $9.95. I'm thinking they're talking about the color match fenders with that. Um, and then the special rims are $1,095. Total MSRP is $55,560. If you want to get your summit price in the upper right hand part of the screen, I get a, a link to our website where you can check this one out if it's still available. Three year 36 bumper to bumper and five year 60 powertrain. There are your fuel economy ratings. And the uh, front crash is fourth, rollover is three. They don't rate it for the rest. 
We'll continue with the walk around here. Uh, basically, gonna, just gonna show you, you got the LED tail lamps on the back. I'm gonna show you the back um, and where that subwoofer is on this vehicle. The matching spare tire and rim. There's your backup cam. Those are HD now, so they're really nice. Uh, you got your case for your hard top pieces, your front hard top pieces. Um, you have three bolts on each side and then two on the top to get this hard top off and then two quick disconnects. I actually have a video showing you how to take it off of a four door, but um, the back is exactly the same, I, I believe, as the four door. So um, it might be a little bit shorter, but it, the principles are the same and the bolts and everything. So. That would be a good tutorial. That video is in the upper right hand part of the screen. And then your subwoofer is back here, which is a nice feature. You got your door hinge and roof bolts and windshield bolts holders back here as well. Those, this back seat folds down and then it actually folds up and you can remove it by uh, pressing this bar down. It'll unlock it and then you can like roll it out to remove the seat completely and put it in your garage or wherever you may want to put it. And then you have that strap there. And then these headrests, they go up. You can put those down for better visibility, just like so. You have your G JL badge right there. Two-door, four-door, wheelbase overall length, water fording, um, all that good stuff on there where it's built and everything. So that's pretty cool too. Those doors shut nice and smoothly. You get the black fuel door on here. And uh, once again, that color match hardtop looks really, really good. Has the enter and go system, the heated mirrors. We're gonna check out the interior just a little bit. Um, not too much to go over, but check out the instrument cluster and the radio. And then we'll turn it on, check out all those HID lights and everything, or LED lights, I should say. You do get a digital speedometer on there. Your, this one has 30 miles on it because it was test driven yesterday. Instrument cluster. Looks really good. You get the leather wrap steering wheel with the red stitching, cruise controls on the right, Bluetooth and information center controls on the left, audio controls on the back. This one does have the 8.4 uh, 4C radio with the factory navigation system, AM, FM, and you can see it has Sirius there. Your cold weather group gives you the heated seats, heated steering wheel, and you can check out your backup camera, which is now HD. So those are really, really nice cameras on there. And those are dynamic grid lines, meaning that they turn as you turn the steering wheel, so that's pretty cool. And if you were to put a hitch there on this vehicle, it would line right up with that center line, which is really nice as well. This one also has off-road pages, projection manager, where you can project your cell phone to a screen via Android Auto or Apple CarPlay. I actually have a demo on Android Auto. If you want to check that out, that's in the upper right-hand part of the screen. We'll check the off-road pages real quick. While it's doing that, you get your more tactile volume, radio controls, and climate controls. Um, you get your off-road pages there loading. And then you have your steering angle, which as you turn the steering wheel, you can see that angle changes. Sway bar connected, front axle um, unlocked, rear axle unlocked. And if you switch those and lock them, those will switch as well. Also tells you if you're, if you're in too high, four high, four low, um, latitude, longitude, altitude, you have your accessory gauges and then your pitch and roll, which would be really handy if you're off-roading. So those are really cool things to have. Down here are your window controls. Your sway bar disconnect is right there. And then your locking axles rear only or the front and rear, you can do that right there. And then there's an off-road mode uh, plus as well. Eight-speed automatic transmission. There's your four-wheel drive shifter. Keyless entry, remote start, has the flipper key really like that and then um, it's really a chunky key fob and then when you're driving it can sit right there in between your cup holders get the red dash on here the red stitching on the top of the dash and uh, front hard top pieces do come off you can just take those off and leave the back piece on if you want assist and SOS buttons right there and then home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lighting systems auto dimming mirror and uh, as promised, we'll start it up, take a look at all those LED lights and everything. Notice you get the LED 
license plate lights as well, LED tail lamps. Really a good looking Wrangler. Um, like I said, it's been the hottest color for the Wranglers that we've seen in quite some time. And uh, it looks really good. Um, and just judging from the videos I've done, this has been the most popular color by far. There are those LED headlamps, LED running lights, LED fog lamps. You also get the LED running lights and the fenders. And uh, just a really cool Jeep. Thanks for checking out the video. I really appreciate it. I highly recommend this Wrangler from a looks, options, color standpoint. And to see more pictures of this Jeep or one of our other 450 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, you name it, we got it. Go to that website right there, summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle from two locations, all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on this video and all the videos that you see there. Click the bell notifications, you'll get updates on videos I do each and every day here at Summit Automotive. In fact, in a second, you'll see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left, a link to more Wrangler videos like this one in the upper right, a link to this vehicle on my website in the lower left, and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out. Actually, I'm gonna put links to how to remove your hard top and the doors in the upper right and, the, and bottom. Um, so check those videos out, and uh, hope you enjoyed it. And thanks again for watching, and remember to like, subscribe, and share on my YouTube channel. I really appreciate it. Thanks again.